I'm taking a look at this Franklin Ace 1000 that Big Steve here in Portland gave me recently. And, uh, well, first thing you always have to do with these is open the power supply and remove the reefas. There were two. And I also removed the filter stuff. And I've shown this in videos before, which is why I'm not making a video about the power supply. There's a little filter board on the back that just has some caps and a coil. And none of that should be there because they go leaky and it will cause your breakers to trip. So all that's been removed, and I put a label here just to say that I did that. Anyways, unknown condition. Uh, yep, three missing keys. I just stuck random keys on that I had. They aren't right, but they work. Uh, form of foil keyboard. Anyways, when you turn this thing on, this is what you get. Normal beep, but that clearly is not happiness. Um, there's a reset button down here. Okay, well, um, so I started looking around. And I was like, uh, what's that? That's not right. <laughs> there, This thing, by the way, was filled with pine needles and debris. So I think this was left outside. I don't know how for how long, but yeah, like I blew out the keyboard. I didn't take it off, but I just blew it out. And there were pine needles flying everywhere. Tons of dead bugs and stuff inside. But that's not right. So let's see if fixing that fixes this computer. Okay, there we go. Let's back in. See what happens. <laughs> Ace 2000 version 2.2. And there it is. So that fixed it. Uh, this machine appears to be working. Now I can't fully test this because of course, foam and foil keyboard. In fact, uh, keyboard's not even plugged in. I Maybe I should plug it in. No, there's no point. This has not been fixed. And if any keys work, there'll be like two or three. So yeah, I suppose what I could do is plug a floppy drive into this disk controller and we can see if it boots software. Oh yeah, let's try that. I moved these into the right slots, slot six, slot three. They were shifted over one for some reason. So I think I have the dead test ROM on a disk here and it requires a machine with 64K of RAM, which this has. So let's see if this boots. Oh. That's not the dead test ROM. That's just locksmith, which we can't do anything with. Since, uh, yeah, I can't, I can't push a key. Well, it loads. So that's a good sign. So this computer is definitely working. How about Fat City? Yes. We all love Fat City, or at least I do. See what happens. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is working. having a little bit of seeking noises there so color is not working because there we go oh it looks great yeah freaking works okay well um no massive video for this computer because there was no fault except for that one chip was out was it this one or that one i forgot i think it was this one because it's cleaner these are all single white sop white <laughs> These are all sim single wipe sockets, so they can be flaky. But um, obviously, if you don't disturb it, it's okay. But if you move them around and stuff and re-deoxid everything, it should fix any kind of weird intermittent faults. This thing is working except for the keyboard. So I'm passing this computer on. I'm going to give this away since I already have a few Franklin Ace 1000s. I don't need another. And of course, the foam and foil process is annoying, so I'm leaving that for someone else to do. So they can go through the joy Thank you for the reset button. There it is. They can go through the joy of redoing the foam and foil. No, thank you. Not for me, but this is a good, good machine. It's a good Apple II plus clone. 64 K of Ram has the 80 column card, which has auto switching, which is very nice. I really like Franklin's design. It's a Videx clone. And then this is the Videx disc two clone. Notice it's got way more chips than the Apple one, but it is, it is fully compatible. All right, there we go. So, yep, if you have a Franklin Ace, you buy one, you got to open the power supply. It's very easy. Just take all the screws out, take those reefers out, and take out the filter stuff on the back. And if you look for Franklin Ace videos on my channel, main channel, I think there was a video about doing that work in the past. All right, there we go.